Hey, what up, decisive marketers? Today we're gonna to be talking about a video hosting tool, and it's called Vtex. But Vtex is not just hosting of your videos; it also does transcription. So whenever you upload your videos. Vtex is going to automatically create the transcription for you so they can use it as subtitles for your videos itself. So the reason why you'll be having uh, video hosting is so that you don't have to host your videos on YouTube because YouTube player inserts ads and recommended videos and that's just going to distract your viewers or you know distract your website visitors uh, when they watch your videos and on top of that uh, video hosting if you were to host uh, your videos uh, as in if you were to upload your videos on your web host is going to take up a lot of of your storage and when you make backups of these uh, of your website is going to you know uh, exponentially increase the storage required for your website and lastly uh, you know uh, it's also for you to you know if your visitors are streaming your videos on your website it's going to take up a lot of bandwidth and slow down your website and also uh, because you may want to protect those videos so if you are selling these video as uh, a paid content you may want to protect your video content right so uh, this too is called vtex but before i dive into vtex be sure to hit that subscribe button if you like to see more digital marketing and e-commerce content so here we are in vtex uh, this is the dashboard is very clean very nice right so uh, the plan that i have right here it shows that i can have up to a thousand videos and a uh, hundred gigabytes of storage with 10 users right so uh, it's uh, so I can have up to a thousand videos but I can have unlimited audios uh, as long as uh, you know it doesn't take up uh, it, it doesn't go above the maximum storage that I have right here okay so uh, let me just close some of these first okay so uh, you can see so the first thing is uh, you know you want to jump into settings so in your settings you can uh, set your videos uh, if you want to have any uh, profanity filter right so this has to do with the transcription itself so if you have videos that contain profanities do you want to automatically filter them out uh, with you know the uh, you know uh, in the uh, transcription itself okay and you can connect vtex with zoom or google drive right so if you have a meeting uh, or webinar on zoom you can automatically save it into vtex vtex is going to transcribe it for you so you know it's a very seamless process right great uh, you know great uh, you know integration i would say and then you can also uh, have uh, you know upload background uh, sounds into vtex as well and you can invite all your team members right here and also your custom domain right so you can uh, add custom domains so that uh, when you share your videos is going to be from your domain itself right so you can have a, a main domain or a sub domain okay right all you need to do is to add a, a record uh, in your DNS settings and point it to this one right here so you know that's all you need to do okay and you can also have video pages so this uh, this would be like your video page okay uh, so they can share your videos at, uh, in one go right so everything is all in here you can uh, there's a search bar for people to search for your videos you can uh, you know filter by duration you can sort by date length and view count right so you can name your uh, video page title and the description as well right here okay so uh, and of course you can also use a C name on the uh, you know uh, video page itself and you can also have uh, you know video uh, sorry audio pages right so 
so I have um, uploaded a video that you can see right here okay so I'm going to jump to that later uh, I'm just going to go into my video projects in here first I'm going to open this up first okay okay uh, so this is the video that I have uploaded okay and what happens is that vtex will automatically uh, let me see okay so vtex will automatically you know set the uh, the the language for me okay and uh, I can add this video to my portfolio uh, which is you know my video page itself I can customize the video I can you know change the name set the thumbnail the visibility of the video the meta title and description and the URL as well and if I want to password protect the video or restrict the video to specific domains only right and then I can enter the domains right here right so that means if I um, if the video is uh, embedded on a site uh, on a domain that is not listed here it will not be able to be played okay and I can add multiple languages if I want to so uh, you know I can uh, you know add text to speech as well right so what happens is I can mute my audio and then um, have a different language to as a text to speech to replace uh, the voice in my video okay and uh, right here this the transcription so I can then you know edit the transcription right here okay right so I can edit the transcription right here right so this is uh, what is being transcribed so as you can see the uh, the transcription of course is not going to be perfect uh, but uh, it seems to be maybe about 90% accuracy I, I would say okay right and then you can also export the uh, transcription if you want to okay right and then if you turn on caption then it's going to show up right here okay and you can embed the player as well right so you can embed the you can embed it with the transcription if you want to so the transcription is going to show up at the bottom or at the right okay or if you just want to embed the video or you just want to embed the video sorry uh, only the video with title and description or just the video without title and description or just video itself right so there's a different uh, different formats right here and if you don't want to show transcript you can do that as well okay so let's say i were to select this one right here let's try this okay i'm gonna save this okay and I'm going to copy the link let's try and open it up on a incognito tab okay so we can see the transcription right here so this is the text so if I click on this it's going to buffer into this spot right here can you see that right so it's going to jump at into like 20 over seconds right here which is just you know great if you want to transcribe your meetings and you know you want to have uh, important uh, you know snippets it's all in here right and then you've got your transcription right here as well you can click and it buffers into a minute 40 seconds so you know vtex is just amazing right here okay so it kind of is like spoke which I've done a review for okay kind of similar to spoke okay and then uh, and then 
I guess right so there's a different uh, position for for this if you want to use uh, you know different layouts and uh, you know you can customize the player as well you can set different uh, primary colors control colors you can set your own custom logo to add a logo on the player itself okay and uh and then you get your iframe code right here which you can embed the video uh anywhere you want okay so pretty much that's what um vtex vtex does right um i think that this is a good solution because you upload your videos is going to automatically transcribe for you you can show the transcription on the page itself if people click on the transcription it's going to buffer uh, or, or it's going to seek to that uh, timestamp and it's going to play from there so this is very good if you if people just want to quickly grab the gist or if it's a meeting uh, minutes you know this does everything for you so that's all i have to share about this uh, tool right here called vtex i think it's amazing uh, i think that it is slightly better in terms of features compared to uh, Vadu TV which I have done a review as well in my channel with Vtex you get the uh, the transcription features and on top of that you can actually restrict videos based on the allowed domains uh, with Vadu TV you can only restrict based on I think like a project level or uh, I think it's on the project level if I'm not wrong so it's not based on the video itself so I guess that's all I have to share it's a great tool if you enjoyed this video do give me a thumbs up if you know anyone who could benefit from a video hosting tool that automatically transcribes for you be sure to share this video with them and lastly let me know what you think about vtex in the comments below and that's all i have to say i'll see you in my next video bye bye